This is the story of this tree. Or rather all the activities that go on around the tree. Here you see a female Cohen. On the lookout for a nest to lay her eggs. And if there is a female, then the male is not far off. The shrill tweed you hear is from a red vented boo boo. But the constant tuk tuk is from a compersmith smith barbet. Our principal character in this story. We are more interested in this coppersmith barbet and her mate. They are building a nest in the tree trunk. The female wags her tail to attract the male, but in this case may be waiting for her mate. She is intrigued by the shriek close by. A flock of parrots was busy on the next branch. A bit of horse play there I suppose. Looks like the young one is being fed. Meanwhile our friend is still on the lookout for her mate. Finally they are together and probably planning for the day. The video is not steady, and a bit out of focus, but one can see what is happening. And off he goes to continue with the nest building. Looks like she is not happy with what he fed her. He works with a single-minded devotion of chipping away the wood to make a cavity. Unfortunately it is on the other side, so we can't see it. In fact he had earlier started chipping on the east side and it had gone fairly deep. But for some reason abandoned it. Is it because it was facing the rising sun and maybe not good for the young one? Or was the wood too hard to chip? Meanwhile the partner is busy close by. She sees some activity high up on the wire. A pair of kingfisher doing the mating dance. The work goes on. The deeper it gets, the more difficult it is to chip out the wood. I like the way he calmly stops and stares. Maybe not happy with the interior design. Another day, same job, but as he came early the sunlight is better. What is commonly known as the morning golden glow. It is during this time that all the birds are very active. And you can hear more chirping. During the course of my shooting, I observed that this particular barbet followed a set routine every day. At the crack of dawn, he sits on the eucalyptus tree close to our house and the toot toot sound is very prominent. Another day, another branch. It almost looked that there is a time slot allotted for each bird on the eucalyptus tree. 
After the barbet moves on, the mina takes over with their shrill shriek. And then comes the fan tail followed by the sunbirds. As the sun goes up, the gray hornbill makes its appearance. Mostly in pairs. At times you can see both the barbets, which is very difficult to capture in video. What you heard just now was the tweet of a fan tail. Other birds seen on the same tree. The sharp curved and pointed beak indicates that it is meant for sucking nectar from the flowers. As the nest building of the barbet continues, we all wait. If there is enough footage there may be a part 2 to this video. Till then, bye from all the winged friends.